can I just say how I was inside the house playing around and then I realized that oh shit it's a Saturday morning and when I checked if I didn't leave within the next minute or two I would have missed the train and the next one after that comes in 30 minutes can't do that definitely would be late now I'm not gonna lie the new schedule I hmm, I kind of like it it's not bad I mean the one extra day I had already kind of gotten used to having three days off so now the one day taken away was just like oh but then I feel like that's the thing too you can't really predict what they're gonna do so you kind of have to make it work but um it's still not so bad and then the times where I leave on the days where I do work kind of works out to the point where I can still be home early and cook and stuff like that or whatever else I was gonna do on the other day where I'm off which most times I don't end up doing nothing productive like one of the days I completely waste just cuz it's like your mind knows that the day is just there so you just waste it so I feel like with it being the way how it is it kind of forces you to be more productive because you only have two days off which it's kind of like okay and now I feel like I like that it's weekdays so if I have anything important to do then I can still get it done because you know some places are not open on the weekends and before this schedule one of my day offs were on a Sunday so the Monday I'd have to cram pretty much all the important stuff that I have to do outside in like business places in on Mondays so now I could do some this day and some the next day knowing that I still have to like meal prep and stuff like that but for the most part I think I can make it work I had breakfast I feel good today is the last day of this crappy shift tomorrow the new shift starts and I work from 10 to 5 either 5 or 5 30 which I really like because I'm gonna get to leave early and with this shift too right now I haven't been able to like schedule time to hang out with my friend just because you know that shift wasn't really that convenient unless I do it on one of my day offs and to go to the Bronx I don't know but now if I leave at like five o'clock or so we could go do something and or maybe not maybe I'd still have to wait until she gets home unless it's like a Friday and Fridays I work till like seven which is still not bad so we can actually hang out anyways and at the train station so about to go casually just chilling at did they get some new buses what casually just chilling at the jamaican restaurant waiting to go to work because as usual i get here a little bit early so i'm just chilling literally just chilling today's gonna be such a long day but then tomorrow makes it all worth it because tomorrow i um tomorrow work from like like i can sleep in for a little bit and then um i still get to go home a little bit early i actually need to check too and like change my alarms to fit whatever the new schedule is so um i don't wake up at like 5 40 because right now my alarm is set for like 5 40 and i don't think i'm gonna need to wake up that early maybe i could set my alarm for like 6 30 and we'll leave at about 7 30 To get here at like 10 o'clock and because i think monday and tuesday i work at 10 or 10 30 like i said i'm gonna have to check anyways i'm at work i don't know if i'm gonna vlog for the rest of the day 
but or maybe when I get home later. I'm not gonna get home until 10 o'clock though. Unless I get a ride, which kind of looks full for that. <laughs> but for right now, but to go. kind of get exhausted the day before like my day off and stuff <sighs> I feel like there's so much to do too the laundry needs to be dropped off because the bags are getting bigger and bigger as the days progress um what do I have to do for myself separate from the laundry I just need to relax for a little bit and sleep <laughs> Tavia I made Tavia's wig because her head is so tiny I had to put some elastics in there so instead of putting one long elastic from one ear to the next i did three tiny pieces so one here one there and one in the back now she's saying the wig is a little puffy which means i i was telling her too when i was sewing the elastic i was telling her that i might have to um the next time I'm making a wig for her i might have to cut out this spot where the elastic is pretty much cut the cap and stitch it back together to cut a few pieces off or so just because the darn um her head is just so tiny so um yeah that is what i might have to do so now she's asking me when and i'm just like listen i'm gonna i'm gonna need you to know that i have a whole ass life that i'm trying to live in between work and trying to fix your wigs your wig problems miss and she was like okay you don't have to yell <laughs> i am tired of these damn wig situations anywho um what was i gonna say just now i just realized that oh one of my old like primary school friends She's trying to hang out because she's just like, oh my gosh, I just realized that we live in the same city and we just have not caught up. And I'm like, yeah, we should certainly do that. But then I also feel like my days, my day offs are so tailored, you know, they're already planned out before I'm even off. Most times they're already planned out before I even know when my day off is going to be. So it's just like I already have so much that I scheduled into the days. We're just like, oh my gosh, she's asking me if 8 p.m. on Wednesday would work. And her name is Latoya. Also, we have the very same birthdays. That's one of the um, dynamics of the friendship that we share. Now I'm going to have to tell her that Wednesday at 8 is going to be too late because Wednesday, I can't do it at 8 o'clock because then I'm going to get back home a little bit later and... I need to sleep early on Wednesday night so that I could be well rested Thursday morning to perform at work. So Wednesday might not work. So probably another week or so. Anyways, I just realized that this vlog that this is going to be added to. I didn't, it doesn't have an ending. So I'm going to just throw this in there and call it a day. And I'm going to wrap this up here and officially start the day off vlogs i don't know what i'm gonna do tomorrow to be honest separate from like meal prepping and stuff i really have no real plans for the day anyways this is where i'm gonna end this video thank you guys for watching hope you guys enjoyed and i'll see you guys in the next one whenever that is i'm gonna go fix my friendship situations right here mm -hmm.